Hi everyone, you're with Sonia from Angel Light Healing. Thank you for joining me today. I have shuffled some angel cards here. We have the angel answers, the archangel oracle cards, and the goddess guidance oracle cards. So I've shuffled the angel answers today because I want to bring some clarity to you guys. So if there is a question that you have in mind, um, ask it now and hopefully these answers will come through to you through these cards. If you don't resonate with this reading, that's fine. Just take what does resonate and leave the rest. If you are after your own uh, personal reading, I do these via email. Shoot me an email at angellighthealing at outlook.com and to angel light, L-Y-T-E. Okay, let's get started with this reading for today. So you have your question in mind. Hopefully we'll get some um, answers for you. The first card you got, is success okay so whatever question you have um, you've been thinking of you've been wondering about there is success around this okay so this is a really positive card so this is um, about your wishes becoming reality success is on its way okay so that's really um, positive and yeah that's a really good card to get okay so look at the light coming through there's divine intervention there's a lot of gold in this card, which is opportunities, uh, which is abundance, which is prosperity. And there's also purple, which is Archangel Michael. So you're very well protected during this change, during this process. So this could be success in a career, success in a move of some sort of home, um, success in love as well. So whatever that question was, there is success. Now to follow on from that card within the next few weeks. Okay, so you'll start to see things changing, things developing for you within the next few weeks. So please pay attention to the signs. The signs may be in the form of numbers, music, feathers, um, rainbows, animals. So yeah, definitely success is coming and it will evolve within the next few weeks. Okay, so that's a great start. The next card from the Archangel Oracle cards is Breathe which is Archangel Raphael. Take several deep breaths and exhale slowly to awaken your energy and to release old patterns. Okay, so Archangel Raphael is the Archangel of Healing, one of the Archangels that works through me when I deliver my healing to my clients. So this Archangel is here to give you some healing today. Um, he's asking you to take a step back, slow down and breathe. This is about centering yourself. This is about grounding yourself. Okay, perhaps you've been going too fast lately. Um, perhaps you've been under a lot of stress so you felt overwhelmed um, with your emotions or around people or, or certain situations, perhaps in the work environment. He's just saying to you, take a step back and breathe. Practice those deep cleansing breaths in order for you to um, ground yourself and reconnect. Okay, now the last three cards from the Goddess Guidance Oracle cards. Kuan Yin, compassion. Release judgments about yourself and others and focus on the love and light that is within everyone. Okay, so this card is all about self-love. The pink represents self-love. So be kind, be gentle and be patient with yourself. Don't try and force things to happen. Okay, so really this card is asking you to sit and go within and go with the flow. So meditation has come up, I've just heard, that's really important for you to ground yourself, to ground your energy and um, a breathing meditation, perhaps um, kundalini yoga would be a great start as well. They're asking you to release any old negativity, any uh, judgments uh, on yourself or judgments on other people. And um, yeah, have compassion for you and compassion for others as well. Okay. So some people may be going through a difficult time at the moment, and that's where the compassion comes in. The next card is Kali, Endings and Beginnings. The old must be released so the new can enter. Okay, so with this card, they're saying that perhaps you're coming to an end with something and there is something new coming your way. And this could definitely be within the next few weeks. There is success, okay? So, yeah, coming to an end. So what is it that doesn't serve you, doesn't serve your highest good? Release and let go of people who don't serve you, um, any negative patterns or toxic behaviours and welcome the new that's coming into your life. Okay, so that's 
a great card there too. And the last card to end your reading is Una. I think that's how you say it. Easy does it. There is no need to hurry or force things to happen. Everything is occurring in perfect timing. Yes, so just as I said, don't try and force things to happen. Go with the flow. There's a beautiful um, dove in this card. So this is promoting more peace into your life. Okay, so just go with the flow. Take your time. Stop and take a breath. Everything will happen for you in the right time, in divine timing. Okay, and more than likely it will be within the next few weeks, success is coming your way. So really just be gentle with yourself, be patient with yourself and others. It's a busy time of year. Okay, so there's no need to hurry or force things to happen. Really um, take some time out, meditate and look after yourself. Okay, all right, so that's your reading for today. A quick one, short one. I uh, pray that you resonate with the messages that have come through for you. Again, if you'd like your own personal reading, I do these via email. It's only $35. So send me an email at angellighthealing at outlook.com or comment below if you'd like a reading. Many angel blessings to you all and have a lovely day. Thanks, guys. Bye.